Federal EMS came to Augusta. They did not bring an emergency medical dispatch system with Gold Cross out of the picture now, along with their dispatch system. The city is taking over those expensive responsibilities. So for now, dispatchers are using a flip book to give medical care over the phone. Our Craig Allison live for us at the Richmond County Dispatch Center. So Craig, the, the big question is how reliable are those flip books? It's a system that changed overnight here at Augusta's E911 Center from April 1st going into April 2nd. Now, some people might be concerned to learn that communication officers here are using a flip book to give out life-saving instructions, but as it turns out, they actually train on this system for six months to up to a year. Up until Gold Cross left, they handled their own 911 medical calls, so the county did not need their own system. We never really had the need to have the software. It actually would have been a waste of money if we had the software that we would never use. The flipbook system they are using right now is only meant as a backup. The dispatch center says they're up to date and reliable in case of medical emergencies to provide on the phone care. But when it comes down to it, we're talking about saving lives. The flipbooks can give dispatchers instructions during emergencies like childbirth, allergic reactions, cardiac arrest, and more. We're the first first responders when it comes down to it. So our ability to try to provide any kind of life-saving instructions until the field units arrive is what's most important to the public. While they say the flip books are reliable, they are already looking towards the future. Richmond County's emergency system has millions in reserve funds. They use those funds to buy a new $130,000 electronic system. With the new system, you, it's at your fingertips and then you can uh, read a little bit better, a little quicker, a little easier. You can ask the appropriate questions a little easier because with the flip charts, you have to go to subtitles, so to speak. At the latest, they say the new electronic system should be in place by around the end of June. But for now, they say that they are ready and able to take your 911 calls in case of an emergency. In Augusta, Craig Allison on your side.